A common perception in our culture today is that Christians just simply hold on to their faith blindly. Uh, that the Christian faith, if pressed, really has no basis in reality. That it's irrational. But is this really the case? I'm joined today by a Christian scholar, Dr. Travis Campbell, who's going to address that question. Uh, Travis, what would you say to somebody who says that Christianity is, is irrational, it's unreasonable? Um, I think the first question I would ask is, what is your standard of reason? What is your standard of rationality? Um, and uh, just to further the dialogue, if, if they appeal to things like the laws of logic, then I would ask what Christian belief breaks the laws of contradiction or excluded middle or any other law of logic you have to offer. Um, if the question is Christians only hold to their faith um, blindly or they don't have a rational basis for their faith, I think that may be true of a lot of Christians. I think that a lot of Christians out there just believe what they've been told by their parents. They just believe what they read in the Bible, but they don't really know of any um, arguments or lines of evidence to support their beliefs. Now, that's not the only option that the Christian has. They can search out uh, evidences and reasons for belief. So I think that if anyone holds to um, any belief without any kind of evidence whatsoever supporting it, that is an irrational faith, but that's not what a Christian has to do.